Hello and welcome back to our Let's Play of Might and Magic Book 1, The Secret of the Inner Sanctum. And so, last time we actually found the secret of Portsmouth. We, you know, ran away from the Queen Succubus. It didn't kill us. We had to change our genders. So I went ahead off camera and changed our genders back. Um, and we were in Portsmouth, but as you can see... We're in Sorpagal now, and what I did was I went ahead and leveled everybody up that could be leveled up, and I also did lots of inventory management. Uh, something cool to point out here is that uh, Warlord Mal now has a battle axe plus two. This actually gives him plus two to might, so it's better than the Flamberge, but not that great. More it's like uh, because we get the might bonus, that's good. Um, and then in other news, let's see. Uh, Ferris, we equipped a lucky charm to her, so she's actually even luckier now, so that's pretty good. And then for Sylvanas, not much has changed. Oh, wait, uh, Grugtar now has a great bow plus one as well. And uh, I think that's kind of it. I did a lot of selling stuff of what we didn't need, and I mean, we have quite a lot of gems, lots of gold, and uh, yeah. So next up on Lord Ironfist's quest is that he wants us to find the pirate's secret cove. And in order to find the pirate's secret cove, we first need to seek out a hermit. And he is in C3. So we're going to go and travel to C3. I don't think I've uh, actually, um, I don't think I've actually cast any of my spells, but that's okay for now. Um, all right, so we are in uh, C3, and we need, to, and this was actually where Lord Kilburn was in the northern area. I can show you on the map. Uh, that's where Lord Kilburn were, was here. Um, oh, okay, so we need to go right here because HE is Hermit. And so the way we need to get there is kind of almost the same way we would get to uh, Lord Kilburn. So. One thing I've noticed, or one thing I know from the guide, is that it says that when we talk to the hermit, he's going to take all our items. And oh boy, that's not going to be good because we actually have some items we might want to keep. Mainly the keys and uh, various, the maps for example, so that's not going to be fun if he's going to take all our items. And I think I can control A through this fight pretty well. So it seems like they do have a lot of people, but we should be okay. And they're all going down, one after the other. I have to uh, tell you something. Um, man, I died to some acidic blobs, and it was quite funny, to be honest with you. I, I tried, and I ended up getting wrecked. And, like, control a through acidic blobs is very dangerous, so I highly recommend not doing it. All right, Kurgan, go ahead and cast um, Fireball on those that are outside of combat. And I think we can just uh, control A through the rest of these. So that's pretty good. And uh, we've got to figure out what actually happens when... Oh, hey, it's Silver Shield. So, all right. So in front of us stands the Hermit. Uh, it's through this wall. And we need to make sure that... What are we going to be missing? So he's going to take uh, lots of stuff. If he takes lots of stuff, then we need to just leave someone in the inn without anything. And that's kind of a bummer, but it is what it is. Uh, or maybe we could just trade it to one of the other characters in the tavern as like a pack mule. But we're going to see if we can get away with this, right? So I'm going to trade Kurgan, our silver shield, and let's try it out. So uh, here we go. The hermit says, trade wares, yes. Okay, and so, wow. Okay, so he feels it, fills it with all a bunch of useless items. Wow, okay. Well, um, I'm going to go off screen for a little bit, and then when we come back, we will be back here, and I will have offloaded all our items to another character in the tavern. So, be right back. Okay, so I went back and traded lots of our critical items back to a uh, the people in the tavern. And uh, they're holding on to it for us. I hope they don't take them and use them. But uh, all right, let's go talk to the hermit now. Yes, and so there we go. There's our pirate's maps, A and B. So let's go ahead and uh, cast 3-2 and go back to C2, which is Sorpagal. And uh, yeah, I will 
I'll go ahead and do the trading off screen for us. And until then, see you soon. Okay, off screen, I went ahead and managed our inventory for us. As you can see, we've kind of sorted things very easily. And uh, let's go back. And now we need to go find this pirate secret cove in A2. Let's go ahead and cast 3-2 and fly to A2. Okay. And we haven't really ever been to A2, but I do see encounters that we can't necessarily do right now. And there is a red dragon here, which we will eventually do. So we can't do that yet. Um, but I think for these other things, we can actually try and like explore and stuff like that. So um, let's go to the pirate's cave like we're supposed to. I think we're going to have to, looks like we're definitely going to have to do some water walking. That's all right. We have a spell for that. Yep. And we can't walk on the beach. So let me cast. I didn't cast our protection stack, but that's okay. So over here, I mean, I... I think we need to rest and then go ahead and cast our protection spells. Why not? Uh, because I have a feeling there's going to be pirates in there, right? That would make sense. But maybe not. Pirate Secret Cove. Search. Uh, yes. Okay. Each share is worth... Wow, cool. That's awesome. All right, let's go over to the other side. See if we can find another... Yep, Pirate Secret Cove. Search, yes. And then... Wow, awesome. Okay, so we found some of the pirate secret, and uh, there is some other stuff here, but we'll probably come back later to the square and, and find some other stuff and try and fight that red dragon, for example. So uh, let's go ahead and cast 3-2, and that's going to bring us back, what is it? Is it B3? I think B3 is the one we need to go to. So let's not go to Portsmouth right now. Let's go and talk to... Um, hey, um... All right, I think we can take these guys, no problem. Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot that cleric. Kurgan, go ahead and cast your lightning bolt spell. And uh, we should be able to just control A through everybody here. No problem. Yeah, gargoyles can hurt. I, I know. Um, and we found a longbow plus one there, so that'll be more gold to our spoils. Man, we are just so rich right now. You know... <sighs> It's sad that gold becomes such a useless resource lots of times. All right, got our quest completed. And what's our next quest? Find the shipwreck of the Jolly Raven. Okay, will do. All right, so let's go back and uh, return to Portsmouth. So we did the quest, and I will look up to find out where we need to go. Let's save our game. But yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. And uh, next time when we return, we will be going to look for that shipwreck. Bye-bye.